Hey guys, so I'm just gonna show you how you guys could do the brake pads on the RAV4 on both sides. It's the same process. Self, this is gonna be for the 22, 24, and 21 RAV4. I believe it's an easy process. So as you can see, I just made a video so that way you guys can actually do it yourself at home, save some money. You're gonna get a caliber press tool at Riley's. Once you get that, you're gonna take off the shims that come with the brake pads alone you can find them easily at your local auto parts store regardless o'reilly's autozone they're both good quality you can go ahead and remove the shims match them up to to the exact one so that way you don't have problems down the road or um sticky pads um you're supposed to grease them up i ran out honestly but this is a, one of the cars that we use on a day-to-day -day basis and i could work on it easily whenever i match it up and i put it up on the actual uh placement that it came off of you put the new pads and then once you put the new pad on one side you're gonna go ahead and repeat the process on the other side once you get the other side you're gonna put the bolt back on on the top on the bottom of the caliper once you get through with that you're gonna go ahead take your caliper place it uh the correct way make sure you put it exactly how it was don't twist the lines that would be bad for you also put the bolts back on start with the top the bottom torque them to spec obviously i'm not going to record every single thing that i do but this is exactly how you are supposed to do your brake pads if you do need to replace the rotors you take off the two bolts from the rotors in the front and you could do the same process um just one more step tying up the bolts once you tighten up the bolts you're going to go ahead and just like i said torque them down you are going to need some sort of clamp or tool so that way the other guide pin doesn't spin while you're trying to tighten up the bolts i usually do them about hand tight and then i go back with the torque wrench um you can see right there i'm really using a smallest Stop. wrench i could find just because i don't want to over torque it once you do you're pretty yes, much sir. wrapping up the brake job um i'm doing the last bit of it which is going to be the top the bottom one once you do the bottom one it's just easy from there and pretty much guys i hope you guys like this video like and subscribe if you want to see more videos now all i have to do is put the tire back on you can stick around hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see more content like this it's just basic maintenance for anybody's car i know the rav4 is a really popular car right now just because every mom is having this car but aside from that hope you enjoy blah 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 goodbye thanks for watching So on this side, pretty much to prep it, I just put some soapy water. And then obviously this is not the right method, but move any residue so I, would, I could pre-cut the film right here. And then I'll do the same process over here. And then I wipe it down and then decontaminate it. And then I start cutting my film on this side and then put it over on this side. So that way we have something like that. Go with some tint, I'm gonna tint the windows real quick. So obviously I'm not the best tinter, but as you can see, I tint the window. Look at that, boom.